You know, a lot of my colleagues actually ask how it is that I'm so successful in what I do. And essentially, it comes down to the fact that I'm always trying to close. I'm always trying to get that get that extra deal, upgrade, upsell, uh, and and you have to you have to do that in this in this day and age. You know, there's there's no sense in, in hiding your light under a bushel. I mean, that's as good as standing still, and standing still is just as good as going backwards. So, you know, you've always got to be proactive and putting yourself forward and getting those those things that you want in order to achieve the success that you're after. So that's primarily what I do. So today, we're actually uh, working on a hot tip that I got from this guy I met down at Pack and Save. Yeah, should be, uh, should be fairly interesting, I think. But uh, as with any hot tip, you, you never really know how it's gonna go until you get in there and actually have a look and see what's, uh, what's happening. Yeah. So hopefully it's uh, it's someone who uh, who has a genuine need that I can fulfil. I'm all about fulfilling needs. Yeah. Except for sponsoring kids. Screw those guys. My name's Andre King, as you can see there, uh, I'm a comedian, a stand-up comic, I'm an actor, I'm a voice artist, I've got all sorts of stuff for you. Uh, look, I've got card tricks, woohoo, card tricks, yeah, pick a card, pick a card, pick a card, any card, name a card, name a card, what's it going to be? Uh, Queen of Hearts. Queen of Hearts, yes, that's it, Way! I know, it's wonderful, it's wonderful, the magic, the magic is here, I'm great with kids, kids love me. That's cool. Look, look, I've got magic, I've got magic. Look, you take two two little scarfy things like this, you tie a knot in the middle there, just like so. Oh, look at it go. Isn't it exciting? It's exciting. It's excitement. I'm all about excitement, right? And all you do is you take this and you tuck it down in front there and then you give it a wee wave and then you grab that side and you grab that side and you end up with, oh, those probably aren't any good. All right, don't worry about that. I also do improv comedy. I've got improv coming out of my ears. I can, I can do improv with pretty much anything. Like uh, the, the fantastic improv, it's amazing improv school. Spent years learning how to, here we go, here we go. Look at this, look at this. Oh no, no. Luke, no, no, no. I am your father. <sighs> See, what do you think, hey, improv? That's no. right, what is that? What is that? Hello. What is that, so, ew. Right, so uh, balloon animals, look at that, balloon animals, hey, for the kids, because kids love me. The kids love me. Love me, children. Kids love me, oh, children, eh, all over the world, all over the world have been entertained by me. Look at that. Here we go, we tie that in the end there. Really fast balloon animals, fastest fingers in the West. Yeah, here we go. So... Doesn't seem to be sort of holding up too well at the moment. It's a worm. Okay, uh, I can do I can do impressions and impersonations as well. Like uh, 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 the, the Bill Cosby, he puts the bills in the people. Oh no, no. It's, a, it's an amazing thing, and today, just for you, half price, love, half half off. Off what? Half off from the, our usual price. Which is. T twice what the price is today. Which is what? Yes, that's right. It's it's half off. Just today, just for you guys. I mean, you you remember uh, what's the guy's name who gathers the trolleys down at Pack and Save? Uh, Kevin Simon. 
Milo Sebasti. I don't know. I can't remember what his name is. He just said Thank that you you, so you were here you and you needed a. I'm really that not, You could I'm use not, a laugh. No, I'm not interested. Sorry. You know, you know. Look at all the effort that I've gone to. I appreciate got, that. Thank you. But I've got a wig on. Look at these ridiculous shoes. They are pretty ridiculous. They look like I've kicked Big Bird to death. Yeah, yeah, I appreciate that, but it just... I've got, I've got real magic. I've got, look, look, look at no, this, look at this. Lights, 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 ooh! Hey, look at that! Ah, whoa! Hi! Come on, it's, uh, it's amazing. Look, look at your kid. Please don't touch my child. Look, I'm sorry, can you just go? But, yeah, I, I'm really quite famous. Yes, yeah, sorry, not interested. Yeah, well, okay. it's fine. I mean, uh, obviously, a good sense of humour is not for everyone, is it? Sorry. Um, <laughs> um, let me help you. No, no, no. Please, no, don't. Don't, 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 don't try and... Don't, don't make out that you clean up. I mean, look at the place. It's a filthy mess. No, it's going. It's okay. Thank you. Good luck. Good luck. I went to Toy for Kari. I don't know what that means. No, of course not. Why would you? I trained at the Royal Shakespeare Academy in London. Right? I am amazing. I even have a comedy mime album out. That's right. Mime. On a record. It's basically four minutes of silence followed by a round Look, of applause. So I'm really sorry. I'm sure you're amazing, but it's just not what we're after. Thank, thank you, though. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. One day, you'll be able to tell your friends that you turned down the opportunity to have someone as amazing as me perform for you. Yeah. Kids love me. Kids love me. It's okay, buddy. He's gone. Well, you can't win them all, can you? There's just no bloody pleasing some people. So much for a hot tap. It's more like a cold prod than a hot tap. Um, so yeah, uh, suffice to say we didn't get the gig. Um, so that means that uh, you know, we're, we're going to be on wheat picks and two-minute noodles again. The, you can't win them all, can you? Of course not, it's like, it's like a lot, it's like a 1 in 27 billion chance of actually making it in this industry. And he's making paper, boo boo! We're having steak tonight! <laughs> no. <laughs> As you may or may not know, Howick has been hit recently with an avalanche of stand up comedians doing comedy in inappropriate places. In order to combat that, I've given them a place where they can go free and go wild. So come along to the Apothecary. August 3rd. Tell them Dave sent you.